See, I don't know how much we've been grinding for this fish. A subscriber sent me this awesome package. We're gonna open it and see what it is and we're gonna talk about how this happened. All right guys, before we get started with this unboxing, I just wanna say a huge thank you to Camilo Alvarez for sending us this awesome, awesome package right here that we're gonna open up for you guys to see, for us to see. And also, I wanna give a huge thanks to everybody that shows support to our videos. For, for showing support on the live streams that we do, for all the donations, everything just goes back into the channel. So huge, huge thank you. Now let's get this thing open and see what it is. So we were on live and I had this rod right here that I've had sitting for a while, which is a Daiwa Coastal SB rod. It's a 10 foot, which is good for jacks. You know, those bigger fish and using lures, you know, but I didn't have a reel for a long time. And I talked about it in the live and Camilo actually asked what reel I wanted to pair up with it. And I just thought it was a simple question. You know, supporters always ask what kind of gear we use, what, what lures we use, everything. I said I wanted a Shimano Saragossa 6000. After the live stream ended, like an hour later, he texted me on Facebook and he was asking to see where I wanted a Shimano Saragossa delivered and I couldn't believe it and I told him he didn't have to do any of that you know just watching commenting liking interacting with the videos is all I need and is the best support that you guys can give me but he insisted and insisted and well here is the package that he sent us See it already, bro. This is crazy, bro. Check that out. We're gonna save this box. Look at that. Shimano Saragossa 6000, the high gear. It's crazy. I've been wanting this reel for a long time since I started fishing, and I just never bought it for some reason. But huge shout out to Camilo. I really appreciate it. This is huge. Hold on, let me not mess up the box. I like to keep the boxes of the reels I get. Here's the manual, you know, for the line, the knob. Check that out. Ooh, that's crazy, bro. I still can't believe it, you guys, you know. I really appreciate you guys always supporting us and something like this is huge and I'm definitely gonna put it to work look how clean that is smooth like butter guys this is gonna be such a great reel especially now that the spring is coming up and as you can see all this stuff we got right here we got lures poppers a whole bunch of spoons right here more lures you know split rings we're getting ready for the jack run this spring this just came in right on time and again it might get annoying but i'm very appreciative of you guys you know always supporting us but we're gonna definitely put it to good use we're gonna catch a lot of big fish on this this year and hopefully get some videos soon but we're actually gonna catch a fish on it this video going on everybody welcome back to another episode of gg anglers we are at the famous texas city floodgate we're gonna see if we can catch some jacks but before we get started we need to talk about a problem that is becoming very common here look at all these trash everywhere you go trash everywhere if you're going to go to any spot you got to make sure you clean after yourself and clean any trash that you see and obviously if we try to clean this up we're going to need multiple bags so it's going to be impossible but yes 
if you're out here fishing or if you're giving spots out make sure to promote cleaning after yourself and cleaning the spot leaving it clean so let's get rigged up well we're already rigged up with spoons but we're gonna start casting already so let's get it let's see if we can find some fish today this is what we're working with shimano saragosa 6000 it's a 10 foot Daiwa coastal sp surf rod i got a three ounce spoon from third coast fishing and tackle with 80 pound mono leader no this is fluorocarbon leader yeah let's get to work we're gonna have to grind for these jacks it feels like we're fishing in a dumpster The current right now is going to the right. So we do hook up, it's gonna be, well, should be easier. Yeah. Hopefully the current makes them run right. I'm under you, bro. Oh, I felt something. Was that you? Oh my God, it was this. Guys, I just snagged the shad. This should be clean. Guys, look at what Brandon just caught. Is, is this considered catching a jack or what? He caught the eye of a jack and they're blowing up like that over the crazy, bro. Mosquitoes. Day 576 chasing jacks. Guys, we just switched sides and we saw two jacks blow up, insane. Now, now it's not non-stop cast, bro. Oh my God, what was that? You saw that? Guys, we're switching back to the other side where we started because we see jacks. We're gonna be here for a couple hours. Nobody's out here, which is very surprising. Mosquitoes going crazy. Jack's going crazy, but let's get it. Dude, I just, you saw it on the other side, right? Come on. We're gonna rig up one of these four inch paddle toes, this bug tail, hopefully that. Makes the jacks bite. 
Maybe they want something green. Uh, the paddle tail might be too big for it, but if it hits, it's gonna get hooked. We'll try for a bit. We're running out of options, so I tied on this huge rattle trap. Looks like a big shad. Makes noise. It wiggles. Maybe, just maybe the jacks want this. Hold on, there's a boat coming, Chris. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. You wrong? Oh, it came off, bro. Oh. So small spoon so far. Oh. You saw a tail? Look at Yes. Finally, come on. Oh my god. He's using that current. Come on. Excuse me. Careful with the rocks. <laughs> that was like the perfect cast. The spoon. Please. No, bro, this is not looking good. All right, guys, we're finally hooked up. It's not landed yet, but very happy to be on a fish finally. I think I'm gonna go left with him. Ah! Watch out the thorns. See, I don't know how much we've been grinding for this fish. They're so strong, bro. It's crazy. Plus the current. Turn, 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 turn. These, this jack, I mean, there's probably more, but they just been feeding on shad, mullet, and other bait fish right on the current over there on the wall. Look, they're still going crazy over there. There's probably trout in there.
He's barely hooked. Got it, please. He's barely hooked, bro. Let's go, dude. Dude, that is a giant. <laughs> Let's go, bro. Look at that. What a giant of a jack. My first jack of 2024. It's been a grind. Let's get it, man. We're gonna try to catch more. We're gonna keep this one for bait. So you don't get it? Look at that huge jack. Oh my God, finally. Finally caught the jack. We've been trying to catch these jacks since March. And for some reason they decided it's only hit live shrimp, live mullet, cup bait, anything but lures. But finally here at the Texas City floodgates, we're finally able to catch ours. All right guys, check out that huge jack right there. Look at that monster. Look at that. Huge shout out to Camilo Alvarez. We were live a couple months ago and he sent us a brand new Shimano Saragossa. He insisted in sending it to us. And look at this first catch, a huge jack here at the floodgates. But the jacks are still blowing up over there in the current. I don't know if you can see it from here, but they're blowing up. All that bait that's getting swept in is just getting devoured by jacks. But if you're still watching, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Till next time.